Tonight you're tuning in to Look Manuscript, an improvised alternative story based on the hopes of yesteryear. Tonight's story is The Thin Man, where we join Nick and Nora Charles. They're a rich and glamorous couple who solve homicides on the side. That story is happening, but so is this one. Telephone. Let's let's answer it, husband. Uh, well, why don't you pick it up? You're closer okay. to it. Yeah, it's ring, on ring, my ring, desk. Ring. Hel- hello, this is the uh, wise cracking duo who solves murders. Also, how, how can we help you today? Oh uh, uh, yes, this is the police chief. I have a crime for you guys to come investigate. That's fantastic. Oh, police chief Wiggum, our favorite favorite guy. That's me. How's it going? Oh, it's pretty good. Well, I mean, there was a crime earlier, so that's not good, but... It's good for business, though, am I right? Yup. We'll be right over. Thank you so much for the call. Uh, Same place as usual? Uh Or should we go directly to the crime scene? Uh, Go directly to the crime scene. All right. If we know where it is, that's a bad sign. Where is it? Well, no, I'm I'm sure you guys will find it. Uh, Look outside your window right now. Hey, honey, look outside the window. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, oh, whoa. Is there uh, flashing lights? Uh, yeah, that, that's it. If, if he's reacting the way I'm hearing, that's it. Is there bad stuff going on down there, honey? Oh, my gosh. The, oh, wow. Oh, I've seen some stuff in my time, but oh, man. Is it pretty oh, honey, out there? Honey, it's like, you remember, like, last week? Yeah, there was, like, a... There was a pretty bad thing that happened. It was like a pile of, you would say, bodies. Would you say a pile of bodies? Oh, uh, yeah, it was a pile of bodies. I sent you guys to that. Yeah, you did that, Chief. But it's worse than this, that? Uh, yeah, honey, this is like ten times at least worse than that. So, like 30 bodies. At least. I, I mean, I see the pile from here. Why are they right? Why is it right outside our office? Chief, we got to go. Thank you for the call. I guess we would have found out about this on our way home, but oh, God. Yeah. If it's th- as bad. Okay. We'll, well go downstairs and check it out. Sounds good. Maybe I'll see you guys there. I, I kind of hope so. I, I like hanging out with if you guys. If you're on the scene, yeah. I think yeah. I actually see. Do you see him, honey? Do you see him out of the side? In his yeah. Calling yeah. Hold on. I'm, I'm waving at you guys. Uh, oh, it is him. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, yeah. we'll be right down. All right. Do you want anything from the, the fridge? We have some refreshments for uh, clients and stuff. Yeah, you guys always bring the best snacks. Why don't you uh, just bring me whatever? whatever. Yeah, we'll hit you up. We got, like, uh, carrot sticks and stuff. All right. And then, like, fancy snacks, you know. Ooh, sh- <laughs> some uh, champagne? Maybe a little champers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bring, bring that down here. All right. Okay. All right, I'll, I'll see you when you get here. Yeah. Love you, bye. All right, go- love you, bye. I mean, we do love him. He gives it, he pays, the the police pay the best. Oh, yeah, for sure. And, like, that guy, he's a freaking riot. I love him. He's so good. Oh, every, our, the holiday party, oh, no, I, I'm there. so he's proud good. of our son. Like, he's grown up, and he's really, like, he, he took our careers, and he, uh, he just really ran with it. I'm proud it's of him. straight and narrow. It's crazy how successful he is. I just, ugh, gotta pack that lunch bag. And you sign the napkin. It's so cute. Yeah. And yeah. you put it in there. But yeah, let's go check out this horrendous thing that he was calling us about. For sure. All right. So. Okay. Close off the lock. Did you lock the honey? Did you lock the office? Uh. Do I have to do everything around here in this? Yeah. 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 I'm. Um, you, do you even have the key? We have two keys. Uh. It sounds like you don't have the key. Because uh, if you lock it in the office, it's th- then it's safe. I put it fine. in the safe. I'm locking your key in the office. That's stupid, though. That's so dumb. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, so wow, this is nice. It's like within walking distance. You know, my my goal this year was to like get more steps. Super nice. Yeah, it's so lovely. Like and like, look, there's birds out chirping don't look over there because you can definitely see the fire from here yep. but like look at the birds yep. oh the, look at that yeah. dog over there look at that dog oh that's oh, a, nice dog. a very cute Ooh. dog i like the dog all right yeah so 
it's, oh. it seems pretty upset by the smell. Oh my gosh, well. yeah. I'm oh wow, I got a yeah. whiff of that. Whew. It's it's almost bearable with the fire though. You know how smoke kind of supersedes all smells, but I mean mm, yeah. Yeah. Whew, wow. Huh. Okay. Okay, so yeah, you saw this from an aerial view. Are you getting anything more? Uh, maybe from. I mean, I'm really starting to think that this is the work of the thin man. Like, only he could do something like this. It's true. Or, or what, she. What are we? We don't even that's, know. Thin woman. Yeah. Maybe. Hey, true. don't don't knock Sorry. it till you try it. You know, I. I'm not. Honey, that's fine. What are we looking at, though? Can you tell me? Okay, what, so it's indescribable. So almost. over here, I'm seeing a pile of bodies. Um, over there, I'd say a pile. Yeah, I'm seeing like a heap of bodies. Um, and then over there, I would say pile. that's like a mound of bodies. No, no, that one's also a heap, and then that one's a mound. That one is for sure mound of bodies. All right, so huh? So yeah, I think ten times was maybe a, you lowballed me there. Oh like, yeah. No, it, it's like nine. Nine and a half. Yeah, so... Uh, how did we not... There must have been a dump truck or something with the backup noise. Boop, boop. You know, like dumping all these bodies. Oh, I think that might be the, the case, but like, if you look across the street, there was a jazz festival this same day. Oh, there was. And lots of beads. They got a lot of beeps and a lot of boops. And it's hard to hear the boop boops over the toot toots and... Whew. Beeps and boops. Plus, there's the robot convention, and that thing just does not help with the beeps and the boops and the toots either. And we went to both. We oh, were yeah. At both. Oh, the robot fest? Oh. Oh. They got it was great when they combined them near the oh, end, though. With yeah. the last two hours where they were like, here's a robot jazz festival. Yeah. The, the Roomba that played trumpet loved that, that guy. That was so crazy. The Roomba trumpet. Oh, my gosh. You, I, the bristles. How does yeah. it even do Amazing. it? Amazing. How does it do it? That's I don't so know. crazy. I loved it though, and the drinks were fantastic. Mm, I am Ugh. still don't tell our son, but I'm kind of buzzed from those. He's gonna get a little buzz from the champers. Don't oh, worry. You're right. You're right. You know, he, don't we, worry. we taught him good. We taught him good taste. It, he likes the champers. He yeah. asked for it specifically. It's his brand. He loves it. That's true. It's not. He didn't make it. It's not. It's his favorite brand. You no. call it your brand. You, yeah. You get it. No, no. This one's his brand. You know, I'm gonna hold on. Gonna finish, yeah. gonna finish this one real quick. Yeah, yeah. He, that's your brand. I get Ooh. it. That stuff. It's strong. a good thing you brought that in a paper bag. Yeah. That, oh, you're right. You're right. A little conduct unbecoming, if you know what I'm saying. But we're not the cops here. That's our son. No. Oh, yeah. our delightful son. Speaking of which, hello. We made it down into this horrific scene. Hello. Oh, hey, mom and dad. How's it going? Hey. Here's your lunch bag with the snacks oh, brought with oh, little champers. Did I get Teddy Grahams in here? Oh, uh, it's the off-brand, the like Coco Te Tigers. Teddy Garms? To Coco Tigers. Oh, Coco Tigers, yeah. Uh, Coco uh, Tigers? I'm not really in like a chocolate mood right now, so I'll just give these over to Davis. Hey, D hey Davis. Coco Tigers, there hey. you go. Uh, oh, Oh, fuck yeah. I love Coco Tigers. Dude. Yeah. Hey, you're doing a good job right now. Hey, keep it up. Hey, Dude. uh, make sure you count. You counted the mound, right, Davis? I counted the mounds, but I also spilled the. You threw them at me and I spilled the Coco Tigers. Oh, well, uh, uh like get into the seeps. It's like seeping. Oh, yeah. Like seeps. The no, seeps. like it's seep. No, no, no. Maybe I, this I is misspoke. a clue. Mom, dad, do you think this no, is a clue? No, it's not. Oh, honey, I, uh, I don't, th we don't, th he misspoke. He but, said seeps. But seeps rhymes with beeps, and we had some of those here earlier, too. You're right. The jazz festival. True. Hmm. Huh. Could this be the break in the case that we needed, that it, we just learned about? I, I think so. I think Davis just cracked this case wide open. Davis, you're doing so good, honey. We'll get you more Coco Tigers later. Oh, yeah, yeah. Davis, you're getting a raise. Oh, Coco Tigers. Thank you. All the oh way. My God, Chief, thank you. That's incredible. Okay. All right. Well, get get CSI to clean up this mess, and I mean the Coco Tigers, not the bodies. Oh, they're, on, they're already on it. Oh, man, they're, those guys. They're that, also getting raised. We got a CSI Roomba, too, coming in. <gasps> Look at uh, them. Darling, though, but the, you could actually be onto something. If Do we need to contact possibly the coordinator of the, the jazz festival if the beeps are... Really, the break in this case, whoever put on that festival, 
was specifically trying to cover up the bodies being dumped here. Am I right? I, 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 honey, I think so. I think this, I think between Davis and our son, like, there's something big here. So we should, like, go over to the jazz festival and see if we can talk to people, see if we can find that coordinator. They're still breaking it down because yeah. it was so rowdy last night. It went yeah. so late. But that's the thing. Under cover of darkness, you get the cover of the beeps and the bloops. You get the cover of the darkness. Yeah. Let's, Sounds let's, like how you make heaps of bodies appear in our alleyway. Heaps? Heaps? Heaps rhymes with sweeps. Heaps and sweeps and beeps. Oh, my goodness. We've got to. And they did it while we sleeps. Honey, this is got This has got to be it. This we has got to be such the good detectives. Man. Let's walk up to the jazz festival. and Do you see... The, the very skinny yeah. woman. And there's a sign here that says, Tonight only, Thinman playing. Stephanie Thinman. Thinman. Stephanie Thinman. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, this. She oh. smells like peppermint, though. Wait, but look at that guy. Oh, that, yeah. That, that person, they're cleaning up. They're dressed in like a, a un- I think they're a janitor. But look, he's pushing that very, broom around. S- very he's sweeping. <gasps> He's sweeping. Sweep. I'm writing it down. I'm yeah. writing it down. Perfect. All right. I'm writing it down. Let's go over there. We're making notes. This is a note for sure. Yeah. All right. Let's go over there and s- talk to that person. See if they can give us any details about. Yeah, anything. yeah, yeah. We'll yeah. talk to the janitor before Stephanie because she has the weirdest v- aura vibe going on. She there. does. It's like very much the the aura of somebody who would make bo- like piles of bodies. It's like a. Scary. Oh yeah. Sca- like yeah. if I had a radio on me, it'd go like. Plus, you know, like, have you seen that her saxophone is like mostly knives? I don't know yeah. how that's a thing. What's up with that? It sounded incredible, but also yeah. looked like mostly knives. Plus, I thought it was like copper or something, and kind of like you know red from the copper. But like, there's something dripping off of that. Actually, yeah. It. I thought it was just rusty because you know jazz players are you know the poorest musicians of all time yeah facts yeah and uh it yeah it might not be rust it might be a gross bloody heap yeah that's from a heap yeah that's neat this is truly right. sweeping us off our feet yeah this right. case it's going crazy we should talk to the to the janitor before the weather comes in it looks like it's about to sleep oh yeah i'm about to yeet ourselves over there Let's do Let's it. Let's do it. Let's talk. God, you're getting so good with that chair. lingo. Hold on. Dab. All right. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's so old. Hey. Yeet's even old, too. Hey, hey, We're janitor. Way come, over come here. Come here. Yes. Janitor, come here. Oh, may I help you? Oh, man. I love your voice, sir. Wow. Thank you. Not enough people compliment my voice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not enough possibly ever will ever do it again i'm so sorry to have done it today but do you know anything about maybe the festival yesterday being tied to anything going on in the alley you know you kind of said that like witty quip but i heard all of that and it might have seemed playful but my feelings are very hurt and i'm not sure i want to talk to you no 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 come on just rib it just jibe and come on you know jazz it's sort of free form i was just are you do you not like jazz? Are you just working I in an event? I hate jazz. I used oh, to be a no. classical musician, and then jazz came in, and all the classical musician jobs were destroyed. Uh, so, what's your story, Mister? I mean, what pe- what uh, what instrument did you used to play? I, I love classical music as well. My name is Veep Beepman, and I used <laughs> to play the clarinet. Oh, yeah, that is a uh, instrument that goes beep, Yes, I would say. But then the Roombas came in, and they learned to play it better than me, and then they turned it to jazz, and I became so bitter. Yeah, yeah, I could see that happening. I became so bitter and angry, I vowed to have revenge on anyone who made the Roombas, and I vowed that I would murder them and pile their bodies in a public display. Our son is approaching us. Hello, son. What did you have something to say about the possibly uniforms of the heaps of bodies? Did they have identification on them? Yeah, they were wearing waiters' uniforms. Waiters' uniforms. That doesn't track. Yeah, that doesn't. It- I think. Well, they were all. They also had like a whole bunch of identification from a Roomba factory, 
And I think they were like having some sort of like costume party. Oh, it does happen to be November 1st on this day, the day after Halloween, a.k.a. when we have jazz and robot festivals. A lot going on last night. But the one tidbit I'm latching on to, just going to keep it in my little pocket of facts, is the whole uh, possibly Roomba employees. What? <laughs> Waiter's uniforms is so weird. That's not even like a costume. Any like superhero costumes or anything? Just all waiters? Uh, well, uh, I mean, it was mainly waiters. I don't know. They must have had some like inside joke with that. That's so weird. Like, they were like, we're all the wait staff. Who's going to feed me? That's so interesting. Ring, okay, ring, ring, well, ring. Uh, son, your phone is going off in your car. Ring, ring. Uh, so, wait, hold on. That's just my cell phone. Mom, can you pick this up real quick? Oh, yeah. Oh, your hands are dirty. Let me put yeah. it in your pocket. Here we go. Okay. Hello, uh, Chief Wiggum's phone. This is uh, his mother. Oh, hello. I am Beep Beep Man, and I just wanted to let you know I ran away when you were you looking. You did. I you killed everybody. Away. I was the thin man. Ooh. You're on record on this, buddy. We're going to catch you. You we thought never it was will. Stephanie, but you just admitted it. We I was of... Stephanie all along. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> oh, no. Will the duo that is comedic and also solves mysteries ever find the thin man who is also stephanie again but maybe also a different stephanie and i'm not what's the if thin man said the so name thin? Thin? let it be known <laughs> stephanie thin mince is not stephanie who owns cheese shop yeah Fact. different either way <laughs> <laughs> thanks for listening to this episode of look mono script and we hope you enjoyed it and we hope you listen to our episode next week because guess what there's another one it's coming out. Always. Always. You can't stop we'll it. See you then. You dab. can't stop us. Dab. I'm uh, going to keep dabbing. Heat. And 4, 420. Furiously dabbing. Thank you for listening. Have a good day. Bye. Bye.